Hey guys, welcome to my new video. In this video, I'm gonna show how to create text animation with using After Effects. Let's get started. So let's go to Takes and write here Y, Classification Tool, and change font size. And let's enable Title Action Save. And hold Alt, double click pen behind the icon for move to anchor point center again. Classification Tool, and go to Align, click this and this icon for move to center text layer. And let's Ctrl D for duplicate and move to right. Let's double click, right E, classification tool, and select E, Ctrl D, move to right, and double click, right S, classification tool. So select these three text layers and move to center. And let's click toggle switch mods. Click this icon for turn on 3D layers. Also, right mouse, compensation settings, go to 3D render, and choose here Cinema 4D. Click OK. And let's change view, first custom view. Click this icon for see background. And right now, select these text layers, go to color, and choose yellow. Click OK. And select these text layers, open inside and geometry options let's change for s extrusion div 100 and go to animate for add shadow colors and side color rgb and let's go to eyedropper choose color yellow and open color cube change to dark yellow for shadow color click ok so let's close inside color and this for E, let's open geometry option and change extrusion dip 100 and go to animate side color RGB and let's use this color for shadow and close settings and select white text and geometry option change 100 extrusion dip and again animate side color RGB and use our dropper for choose yellow color. So let's close settings and right mouse new viewer. So right now we have two viewers. This is active camera and this is view custom one. So in this time select these text layers and go to here and press P. Let's create new passing Q frame. Go to back and select this first Y. Let's Move to front with Z axis. Let's move to more. And select text E. Again, Z axis, move to front. Okay, and let's change quality for now, quarter. And select S, also move to front. And select Q frames, make it easy. Go to Graph Editor and choose less Q frames, move to left. Let's see. Okay, let's back to Q frames. And in this time, select this text S. Let's move to left like this. Let's see animation. Okay. And text Y, move to left. Okay, and Select these three text layers, go to last second and press R, create Y and X rotations. Go to here and let's change rotations like this. Let's see. Okay. And select these keyframes, let's move to left and make it keyframes easy. And select less rotation to frame of the left. Let's see. Okay, this is not bad. And let's select this S and change rotations more. Okay, not bad. And select this text E, go to here and change rotation like this. Let's see. And select rotation keyframes, make it easy. 
and move to left. Nice, not bad. And finally, select this text Y. Go to here and change Y like this and X rotation. Select Q frames, make it easy and move to left. Okay, let's move to right for now and select X rotation change rotation more and again move to left let's pre animation okay that's good so let's close this view also this and let's close settings press n for select work area nice very good let's unlock background Select this background, Control D, and change name grid. And I'm gonna use my favorite background effect grid. Let's delete fill and go to FS Presses, search effect grid, and let's choose grid from generate folder, use for grid solid layer, and change size form with slider, and change slider like this, and opacity. And let's select these text layers, press U, and go to here. Select these last position Q frames. Let's move to like this. And this E layer, let's move to front, and change view top. Okay, let's move to like this. And layer Y. Also move to front. And let's see. Okay, very nice. I like it. So guys, thank you for watching my video. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Like video, leave comments and have a good day. Good luck.